everybody, this is Zeno, and welcome to the Dynamic Purple Waltz, my favorite time of month again, time for Survival Boxes, the gear only XL box for April 2018. If you are unfamiliar with Survival Boxes, you can check them out over at survivalboxes.com, I will put a link down in the description below, and what they are is a monthly subscription box service that delivers to your door each and every month a box full of awesome gear for your outdoor adventures, natural disasters, and man-made disasters. While you're out there, you can take a look at the other boxes that they offer, including the Alpha Box, the Bravo Box, the Gear Only, the Gear Only XL, and the, of course, Water Box. Like I said, this is the Gear Only XL Box. This goes for $89.99 per month. Without further ado, let's go ahead and get into April 2018 Gear Only XL Box. All right. Ooh, very nice. All right, let's go ahead and take a look at our Survival Boxes card, uh, new and revamped with the new Survival Boxes uh, Gear Only XL box. Uh, this will have all the breakdowns of all the boxes for this particular month, including uh, our themes and whatnot. Every item that comes in each box is along with values. Of course, we're going to be concentrating down here with the Survival Boxes Gear Only XL. Uh, price on this box, again, is $89.99. Our total value was $155.18, and of course, uh, those are uh, the lowest online Amazon pricing. So Survival Boxes uh, prices via Amazon pricing, so you're guaranteed uh, the lowest price. Uh, this month's theme is Tent and Tarp Shelter for Survival. So first up is our Survival Knowledge Card. This is Survival Knowledge Card number 27, dealing with uh, tent and tarp construction, how to build an emergency tarp shelter, where to pitch a tent. Of course, these Survival Knowledge Cards can be easily and conveniently placed in your small three-ring binder that you get with your new member welcome box. So this you'll, you'll get this three-ring binder uh, when you first sign up and you get your very first uh, box. And then all you do is file this right in there with all the rest of them. Let's slip that in there. File that away in your little three ring binder box and then after a while you've collected a number of these, you've got yourself a nice little reference. And if you are new to uh, survival boxes, you can purchase past uh, survival knowledge cards on their website. A pack full of uh, all the ones that you've missed available for about five or six bucks uh, on their website. All right, so let's go ahead and get into this guy. Let's go with the big guy right up front here. This is uh, from Stan Sport, the Scout Backpack Tent. Two person, two season tent. Uh, price on that guy is $34.99, the Stan Sport Scout two person backpacking tent. Nice little small tent there. Small, compact, lightweight, easy to pitch. Um, everything's included. Designed for backpackers, classic uh, Scout Troop camp tent, proven A frame design, lightweight, compact, easy to assemble, 800 millimeter PU coated polyester upper body with rugged PE floor, no CM mesh indoor screen, two steel poles, ropes, stakes, and carry bag included, and also has a flame retardant coating. Scout backpacking tent from Stansport. Price on that again was $34.99. All right, that was our big item in there. Let's kind of go through here. Here we have a tarp. Let's take a look at this. Uh, from UST, all weather tarp, ultra light and compact. Cool. So we got a tent, and now we got a tarp. Let's take a look at this guy. A nice little stuff sack there. Thermal protection, weather protection, ground cloth, reflective for signaling. There we go. So we have some supplies in here. Let's see. Looks like some tent stakes. Probably some cordage, I would imagine. Yep. So we have some guy lines there, and some tent stakes, so six tent stakes in there. Really cool, nice little bag. And then here is our tarp. It's got some little nylon webbing corners there, so to uh, facilitate staking that down. Big logo in the middle, some more. Of course, it has that reflective side on it, so you can use it as like an emergency blanket um, to reflect heat in, or you can, as it says, use it for signaling also. Very cool. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna rip out the whole thing here, but this is actually a really nice tarp. A lot of, a uh, lot of extra accessories, all ready to go to build into a shelter or emergency shelter uh, for you or weather protection over an existing shelter. So, for instance, you can pitch a tent and pitch a tarp over it. That really helps a lot in uh, 
in uh, getting uh, protecting you from the elements. So, all right, very cool. Uh, price on this guy was twenty nine ninety nine. Alrighty, got that back in the and our little stuff sack there. That was a UST all weather tarp. Very cool. Moving along here, what else do we got? We have from uh, Fixin' Zip replacement zipper sliders. Boy, that's a nice thing to have laying around. I can't tell you how many times I've busted zippers on stuff and wish I had a little emergency zipper kit that I could fix that on the go. So here you go. Fits a range of sizes. Includes small, medium, and large zippers. Replacement zippers. Has a little uh, kind of zipper mouth there along with some clips, um, some rings. Uh, so you can get it all instructions on the back on how you can repair a broken zipper on a um, you know jacket, a bag, a tent. A uh, sleeping bag, a purse, whatever you need. Keep a few of these around in a small little kit. I actually do have a little sort of sewing and maintenance kit in my EDC bag and also in my bug out bag. This would be a nice little uh, addition to that too. Throw a couple of these in there just in case you have a zipper that fails. So the uh, Fixin' Zip Gear Zipper 3 Pack, that goes for $24.99. Okay, let's see here. Next up we have from Coleman. We, oh, we got a knife. We got a knife from Coleman. Let's take a look at this guy, shall we? Little carrying case here. Let's fold her. There it is. There it is. It's a nice little knife. Uh, kind of a rubberized um, grip there. It's a liner lock, as you can tell. Coated blade. Doesn't say what steel that is on there. Some jimping on the back. Fairly lightweight. Feels decent in the hand. Is it sharp? Eh, yeah, it's reasonably sharp. Not the sharpest blade I've ever felt, but reasonably sharp. So, certainly uh, a blade that you could find uh, some good uses for. Uh, this is the Coleman Liner Lock Knife. Price on this is $17.95 in the box. Okay, now we've got uh, ooh, Kearshock Camp Series. Got a brochure here for our next blade, which is right here. Look at this. This, I can tell you just by looking at it, is the Kearshock Camp 10. Look at this guy. It's a big dude. That is a big dude. Let's take a closer look at it, shall we? Ooh, got some protective, got a protective film there. We'll just take that off. A little bit of uh, packing oil on there. Let's uh, go ahead and wipe that off real quick. Otherwise, everyone's gonna be like, "What's with the goofy texture?" All right, just give it a quick wipe down, get most of that packing oil off. Didn't get quite all of it off, but there you go. That is the Kershaw Camp 10. Look at that guy, huh? Very cool. That's a big dude right there. 10 inch blade, really nice uh, really nice grip on this too. I like it a lot. It's got a real positive feel to it. Uh, I know some people who have um, use these uh, in the past think that this grip is a little aggressive um, that I actually like that that's good I'm the kind of guy who's more likely to put like uh, skateboard grip tape on stuff and uh, I love talon grips on my on my firearms I love textured uh, really heavy texture for stuff for really good purchase so that it's kind of right up my alley I like that a lot that feels really good in the hand yeah that's very ergonomic feels good weight Balance is okay. I mean, it's a it's a long blade, so balance isn't going to be great on these. Very cool. Has this uh, sheath? Looks like it's made out of plastic. Yep. And fit is hmm, little little loose in there. Little bit loose. No real retention on its own in there, other than using the strap. But uh, this is also not a very expensive knife, so we're not going to hold it to some huge you know, bar here. <laughs> this is not uh, 
of an overly expensive blade. Price on this guy is uh, 40 bucks for the whole kit, so uh, definitely a little bit more of a budget oriented uh, blade, especially at this size. So there you go, that's the Kearshock Camp 10. Nice big blade for your camping adventures. And uh, let's check it out. Nice little brochure there. Shows you everything there is to know about the uh, the blade itself and all the different carry options, care and maintenance, uh, everything you need to know right there. So there it is. Again, price on that was 40 bucks. I think that looks like everything. It is. All right, let's get the box out of the way. All right, so let's very quickly review everything that came in this one. Survival boxes, gear only, uh, XL box for April 2018. Our theme again was tents and tarp shelter for survival. Our first item, of course, was a survival knowledge card. That was number 27. Uh, next up, we had the Stan Sport uh, Scout Backpacking Tent right there. Uh, after that we had the UST uh, all-weather tarp, lightweight and compact tarp. I really like that tarp by the way, that's a pretty nice uh, tarp. Uh, after that we had the Fixin Zip uh, zipper replacement uh, system there. After that we had the Coleman flipper. Little, uh, little EDC knife there for you with the case. And then of course we had the Kirshaw Camp 10 knife to go along with that. All right, so that was everything that came in this month's uh, Gear Only XL box. Uh, we got a tent, we got a tarp, we got some knives. Can't complain about that. All right, take it easy, everybody. Have a good one.